Today's show is next. That's what's happening today in New York. What? Good morning, recovery effort. Hillary Clinton and her aides scrambling to explain why she wasn't more upfront about her pneumonia diagnosis. The candidate herself speaking out last night. I, I just didn't think it was going to be that big a deal. Does downplaying her health scare play right into the hands of her critics? As our new poll shows, the race is tightening. Is this the arsonist? Police step up the search for a man caught on camera running from the scene of that devastating fire at a Florida mosque. Investigators labeling it a possible hate crime. Was the suspect targeting Muslims? Golden parachute, new outrage aimed at Wells Fargo. Why the executive in charge of the unit just busted for opening millions of fake accounts is getting a nearly $125 million payout. And Lochte's bad night. Excuse me. Oh, oh. Excuse me. Wow. The Olympic swimmer interrupted on stage during his Dancing with the Stars debut. At least two men arrested and Lochte in shock. It honestly feels like someone reached inside, took out my heart, and just stepped on it. His hopes of waltzing his way to a comeback hitting a sour note today, September 13th, 2016. From NBC News, this is Today with Matt Lauer and Savannah Guthrie. Live from Studio 1A in Rockefeller Plaza. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to today. It's a Tuesday morning. Willie's in for Matt once again. Wow, what a scene last night. Well, two people were arrested while Ryan Lochte was dancing. There were more protests in the crowd. Of all the protests we've seen lately in politics and sports, competitive dancing, not somewhere I thought we'd see it as well. <laughs> I know. We're going to have a little bit more on that in a minute, but we've got politics at the top, of course. The election just 56 days away now, so let's get right to the state of the race. Donald Trump hosting a rally in Iowa this afternoon before heading to Pennsylvania for an event there tonight. They will be his fourth visits to those states since becoming the Republican nominee. Hillary Clinton getting help.